Hey guys and welcome back to another creepy text chat story. Today we are reading Kidnapped on Hooked. I hope you're excited because I am. The synopsis for the story is Ella wakes up alone. She doesn't know where she is or how she got there. Are you there? I'm in trouble. Please answer me. Please, 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 please. I'm here. What's up? Are you okay? No, I'm in serious trouble. Why? Where are you? I don't know. I think I've been kidnapped. What? Call the cops. Tried. No answer. Makes no sense. Keep trying. I don't know where I am. I'm calling you now. No! Can't make any noise. I hear people. Strange sounds. I'm so scared. Are you hurt? Blood in my hair. Sticky but okay. I meant scared by the way, not scared. I'll call 911. Tell me where you are. Don't know. Woke up here. How did you get there? I don't know. I was knocked out. By who? I don't know. What's the last thing you remember? Driving. Did you stop somewhere? Don't remember. Just remember someone screaming. Car accident. Jacob, I'm telling you I don't know. You may have a concussion. How can you tell? I don't know. Ah, I hear someone screaming. Please help. Describe where you are. Some kind of basement. Bare walls. Smells like chemicals. Any windows? No. Maybe a chemical plant. Nearest one is at the edge of town. I'm going to die here, aren't I? No, you are not. Don't say that. Someone's coming. Can you hide? You okay? L, you okay? Calling 911. I'm here. What happened? I had to run. I'm safe now. Something chased me. I couldn't see it. I heard it. Where are you now? I don't know. These walls look like stone. Rough. And it's hot as hell. Are there tanks? Vats? Anything with symbols or a logo on them? No. I called 911 but they can't send anyone unless they know where you are. Jesus L, please give me something to go on. It's darker here. Chemical smell is stronger like gross rotten eggs. Screams coming from below. There must be a sub-basement. Do you see stairs? No. I'll look. Be careful. Jesus, there are so many people screaming. What is this place? So scared. You'll be okay. Something is rumbling. Getting louder. The ground is vibrating. Do you see anything? Like a kiln or a furnace? No, but it's getting hotter. Look for a way out. But be careful. Sorry about last night. Don't worry about that now. I want to tell you something. Just look for a way out. If I'm going to die, I want to explain. Stop! You are not going to die! I wanted you to kiss me last night, but I was so scared. Of me? No, me. Tell me later. Look for a way out! Liked you for a long time. Really liked you. Me too. But I didn't want you to get too close. What are you talking about? I'm not a good person. Not true. You are awesome. You don't know me. Please stop, figure out where you are. At my old school, I did something terrible. It's hard to talk about. Then don't. Some girls and I used to pick on a kid named Lisa. She didn't have any friends, family, no money. She had nothing. One day we shut her in a locker and pulled the fire alarm. It was an hour before they found her screaming. Stupid prank, you are not the first. Thing is, she was claustrophobic. When they got her out, her hands were ripped and bleeding from where she tried to claw her way out. But it was her mind that was really damaged. I'm so sorry. That's so messed up. But it's not like you killed her. No. She killed herself. Two weeks later. Hung herself in that locker room. You can't blame yourself. You didn't know what she would do. But I can. I do. Blame myself. I killed her. You didn't. Saddest part is we were best friends as kids. Used to play Barbies. And I killed her. You didn't. Maybe I deserve whatever is happening to me. Ella, stop. You are not being punished. My parents made me switch schools. You were nice to me on my first day. I wanted to tell you about what had happened, but I was too scared that you'd hate me. I could never hate you. I'm going to hell for it. Stop. Please stop. You are not going to hell. I'm glad I told you at least. I'm going to find you, okay? I don't think you can. I think I know where I am now. Wait. Your pick is on the news. It says you were in a car accident. Please. God, don't let this be true. It said you died. Jake, please. It feels like this place is on fire. Jake, help me. What's going on? Oh God, please, it's so hot, it hurts. Please, Jake, help me. He's coming. Who's coming? The devil. 
and that is where it ends oh my gosh i am shook that was so interesting honestly all the way through that i thought that she was being kidnapped by someone actually turns out that she was in a car accident and she died and she went to hell she was texting Jake somehow, I don't know how, as a spirit, and then ended up finding out that she died. Then the devil must have got to her, so now she's trapped in hell for eternity to pay for the sins she committed. That was honestly a pretty cool story, and I really enjoyed that, even though it's kind of creepy. If you guys did enjoy it too, and you want me to read more hooked stories, let me know in the comments section down below. Hope we're all having a wonderful day, and I will see you guys in the next one.